Good day guys. Um, today we are here to answer a short um, essay question that students in an examination were asked to answer. And um, in this question, um, they were asked to discuss the safety muscle of the tongue, right? They said, I discuss the safety muscle of the tongue. So now, first of all, you need to know among the muscles of the tongue, which of the muscles is actually the safety muscle of the tongue. And why is it called the safety muscle of the tongue? So, safety muscle of the tongue, let's proceed. Um, we see so many uh, pictures. In these pictures, I would like us to note um, the genial glossus, right? Genial glossus. In this next picture too, I would like you to note where the genial glossus are. Beneath the tongue, okay? Genial glossus. Now, say so that genial glossus is called the safety muscle of the tongue. Now, Next is to talk about why. Now, this is because the two genial glossa form the bulk of the tongue, right? Um, these are the two uh, genial glossi, all right? They are paired, all right? And they form the bulk of the tongue. And they are responsible for the protrusion of the tongue, right? Responsible for taking your tongue out. Okay? That is the function of the genial glossus. Now, we see. If these muscles are paralyzed, of course, you know that your tongue, you cannot protrude your tongue again. The tongue will fall back into the esophagus, obstructing air passage, causing choking and death. Okay? If the, the general glossus that is helping to hold the tongue in, in its position and protruding the tongue, if this muscle uh, is, uh, is paralyzed, the tongue will fall back into the esophagus. And this will block your air passage, all right? And when your air passage is blocked, you know, air is life. This will cause you to choke and die, right? We have done answering the question on the safety muscle of the tongue. I'll see you guys in the next.